I'm John Inverdell, I present uh, radio and TV programmes on the BBC. The thing about sport at university for me was that, you know, it fitted in around lectures, um, or other way around, I think it probably was, and, you know, I, I, it's just the friends you made. I mean, I played rugby and tennis and squash and cricket, and basically anything that was going. And the, the overwhelming majority of the friends that I've, you know, really good friends that I've still got, are people that I played sport with at university. It, you know, it was an extension of what I'd done at school, you know, slightly higher quality, a lot of it. Uh, but it was, I think you grow up so much more at university, and the, and the friends that you make there are friends that often that you keep for life, and I have. Well, universities contribute to society in so many ways, you know, whether it's, you know, the, the building that you're looking at at, the, at this very moment, uh, which was built probably by people who have engineering degrees and you're not feeling very well because you've got sniffs and snuffles so you go to your GP and the doctor probably went to university. But I do think one of the great developments in this country over the last 20, 30 years has been the kind of sport for all mentality in terms of athletics, in terms of running, marathons, you know, 10Ks, fun runs, all that sort of stuff. And uh, the, the, the cycling boom that has happened in the last few years you know, not just off the back of the successes of Chris Hoy and Mark Cavendish and people, but just because of clever marketing as well, realising that the, again, the, the, it's that kind of camaraderie and friendship that can be created by doing a mass participation event. And the cycling world's got, got hold of that as well. You know, swimming to a lesser extent. I think that's one of the really big, big developments over the last 10, 20 years. And, you know, it's helping general health levels amongst, you know, members of the population as well. But the other thing as well, which we don't ever talk about enough, is actually fun. It's really, really good fun. And I sometimes think when people try and market sport, that's the one element they actually overlook. It's just really, really good fun. And the Olympics mean to me just the greatest, it is the greatest show on earth. And in a kind of a peace, love and understanding kind of way, I really do, when I walk around the, the Olympic Village and just see all these young people from all over the world, and some not so young as well, uh, competing, I just think this is just bloody marvellous. I'm proud to be part of Universities Week because, you know, they always say, oh, school days are the happiest days of your life. I don't believe that for a moment, but University Days undoubtedly are.